How's it going, Tricks, mates? This is Mr. Charles, and we're back with Tomb Raider the second. Now I've finally beaten Cube Escape. I can actually get back to the real puzzle game of the series. And little cause for celebration. I believe this is the hundredth Tomb Raider episode I have done on this channel. According to the playlist, this is the hundredth episode. So. I don't know why I'm clapping my hands, it's just a fucking uh, list of, uh, like, episodes, but still, I'm actually quite proud of that. That this game might actually, well, this series might overtake Monster Sweethearts, which I think is my record at 120-something. But still, I just feel quite proud that Tomb Raider's actually become this significant a part of the channel. Right. Previously, we worked our way through men. We worked our way through jumping. We, uh, we got past that bedchamber, which literally pissed me off to death. Now, I can finally cross the swimming pool. I've got to be careful of my guns. I've got to be careful of whatever could come at my way. If I'll be alright. Don't worry if I, I'm in danger. I can just save a million times, as I'm used to by now. Right, let's go over here. Have a nice swim. Didn't really need to go down there, but Laura insisted on doing a nice dive. God said I have fucking missed Tomb Raider. Like, I miss getting angry at it. I miss playing it. I miss, you know, finding out the story. Okay, we can't go down there. So I need to get up here, I imagine. I, no, I'm not going to be able to go through there, though, am I? Alright, I'll just jump through the window. Whee! Oh, okay, I can't do that. Okay, I'll just shoot the window. Whee! Okay, I can't shoot the window. Whee! Alright, so what can I do, game? Hmm, I'm, I better get my pistols out. I'm not going to, like, use my pistols up on something stupid. Right. It appears these are bulletproof and I, I can't get in. Um, can I maybe climb this bit? No. Can I maybe shoot these things? Yeah, Laura, I know I've just come back. You don't have to be frustrating from the get-go. Okay, get oh, okay, what's this? Is, was it easy? that easy? I just need to do the switch and then I'll be alright. Right, that could be literally anywhere. That could be on Mars for all I know. Okay, uh, so I've opened up some kind of portal, some kind of entrance to another landscape. Maybe like a little bit down here, a nice little hole I can enter. Laura does like her holes, likes crawling in them, likes jumping in them, likes falling in them and then dying. Very rarely she'll actually fall in them and not die, but you know, that is quite a, quite a spectacle. It's kind of like a lunar eclipse, it only happens every like 100 years or some shit. Okay, the alarm's going off. That's going to annoy me. I'm trying to remember. There was a ventilation system up there. Is that something I should focus on, maybe? I'm going to try that. Yes! Cool. I mean, I'm sure like any game in this fucking channel of mine. If I just wander around enough, I'll eventually get what I want. I'm just going to save because if I fall down, I don't want to get back up. It might not even be this way, but again, I can give it a go. Yeah, no. Oh, <laughs> yeah, why am I not surprised that happened? God, why couldn't they just make this jump nice and easy and convenient for all? No. Yes, that's fine. Yes, just go up. I don't care. You don't have to jiggle around like a jelly bean. Like a weird, demented jelly bean. Right, is there something up there? Okay, no. I don't think so anyway. Right, this leads to the this bit. Okay, Laura doesn't want to say yes to that. So, is this the bit that was opened? Where does it lead, I wonder? Is it going to lead me somewhere underground? London underground, London underground, I don't want to drown in this game. Okay, well, that was alright. We're definitely somewhere new. So, things are looking up. Pretty, pretty sure I'm going to find a man in a minute. He's going to ruin everything for me, as men do. Uh, but the, what the fuck was wrong with that wall? Oh, well, it looks like the men are now trying to fuse themselves into the concrete. Takes one to know one, I guess. If that's what they want to do with their lives, I'm not going to judge them. Why not? If you want to fuse into the concrete, that is your divine right as a male. Your penis will allow you many benefits if you fucking have one. I, Laura, do not have the benefits of having a penis, unlike you men. But whatever. Uh, that was a promising noise. I don't think I have to worry about it, though. I do think I'm going to have to worry if I go down here, though. I don't want to drown myself, so we're not going to think about that. So I guess I'm going to be saving it literally every jump now, because, you know, I'm nervous. I 
I'm guessing I need to go over this bit. It's nice to see the jumping puzzles getting complex, to be honest. Oh, Jesus, that nearly killed me. Well, they, well nearly got me down there. I don't want to go down there, if I'm honest. Uh, okay, still, you know, not going to be that bad. No, oh, God, what? I can't... Oh, I can see you now. Yeah, what are you going to do? Run around in circles? What a smart person. That's what I would do in such a situation as this. All right, well, I don't want to deal with that crap. There's a motorbike outside, which is, I, I think, really trying to, you know, make some noise. I think someone's showing off outside. Please don't. Thank you. Please don't thank you. Yeah, literally, I don't mind if you have manners, guys. You can just, you know, tell me to fuck off if you really want. Please don't close this tab. I love you. Okay, well, anyway. Nice little gap there, which leads fucking no what was a ladder, I guess. Oh, is that the way back up if I, you know, fell to my death? Well, I didn't do that. Or I like, fell into the water. Same thing, really, because I'll feel like death after I lose something like that. Uh, have you got... Is that a shotgun? Oh, yes! Uh -huh. Hail and sister, what have you done? Hail and sister, who's your only one? I've been waiting for so long, so long. It's a nice day for a white wedding. I know I missed a few words there, but fuck it. Fuck it all to death. All right, well, anyway... Let's jump over here, but is there anything I can do? Oh, good, I didn't know you were there. Mr. Man trying to ruin my plan. Good rhyme there, good rhyme. Yep, do it. Yep. Yep. Wow, him falling on me actually injured me. I mean, I guess it was kind of scary. I can't really take big muscly boys like that. There's a guy over there as well. Fuck's sake, these guys are literally just desperate. They are, there are no women in this area. They're hard hell bent for fucking action. Please just, no, don't spin in circles. That just makes it harder for me to get you. Like over here. Yep, now what are you going to do? Die, that's what I thought. Right, so more shit going on. Probably another long jump. I'm too lazy to save even though I really fucking should. There's also a little bit up there. Okay, I'm suddenly more active to save now after I've seen that. So, yeah. Cool. Then, what's up here? Is it a secret? Is it a gun? Is it something that might actually help me in this game? I wouldn't be used to that, to be honest. Or is it actually where I'm meant to go? Because that would be boring. It'd be nice, but, you know, I'd expect more from you, game. Oh, God, where's this leading? Wait, have I gone in a circle? I, I, what? Is this, I don't know, is this the same way it was before? Because that's when the drop wasn't this far down. I don't think it was anyway. And there's no way it was this far down. Where the fuck is this leading me? Okay. Where's this bit? No! Okay, well thank God I didn't die there. That's one of those lunar eclipses I was talking about. Go away, go away. Yeah, thank you. Oh, he has a health pack. At least I get some, like, insurance there. A bit of, uh, you know, help with making sure I don't die suddenly. Okay, has that looped moved? What was a man doing there, then? Okay, for some reason, I don't think I, I did what I was meant to do. Uh, I don't know if I should load the game or just try and go back. There's no way I can jump up this bit, can I? Oh, no. Alright, I guess we're looping around then. Yay! Oh, I like going in circles. It's, re it's really good exercise for your little legs to go round in circles and just suffer. Just plain up suffer, really. It's really good for those little tiny legs of yours. Alright, is there at least a quick way to get back to where I was before? Probably not, but, you know. I need to go over there, but I can't. If I try and jump that, Laura's going to jump into an invisible barrier, and then I'm going to hate life. So I'm not going to do that. I'm just going to try and make my way across. If I die, well, I'll just load back to where I was before. Yep, good, good catch, Laura. Really strong fingers. Wish I had strong fingers like yours. You think I'm joking? I am so bad at rock climbing. Like, literally, I had an, an ex I used to go rock climbing with once or twice in a little little down centre in uh, in Bournemouth. They had like a rock climbing thing outside. I don't know if they still do it. 
It was like, I think it might have been Go Ape or something. I don't actually remember it off the top of my head. But anyway, I did some of that shit. And I could last five seconds on a rock. And then, and then I'd die. No. Oh, well, I just saw my life flash before my eyes. That was good. It wasn't really fun. But uh, it was just full of Tomb Raider. Tomb Raider just being like, ah! Like a fucking eagle. All right, fine. Well, anyway, I just wish I had Laura's fingers. I don't know what kind of thing she does to those fingers to make them actually work as well as they do. Because she can just indefinitely hold onto a cliff, and I think that's unnatural. I think that would literally break me if that happened to me. Jump over here. I can't be asked to wait. Okay, good. Uh, uh, wait, how am I meant to get to the, the bit over there? Surely there must be something I'm missing. Okay, I nearly fell to my death. That was funny. Ha ha ha. Right, this bit here, I'm going to have to short jump it. So this is definitely going to take a few tries. <laughs> Fine, good. It's just 118, 118 now. Oh, oh, okay. That was surprisingly easier than I expected. Do you have anything on you, friend? I'd love to pick up your gun, but unfortunately it's not separated from your body. It's a part of you. Are you wearing a hat like Ash Ketchum? Or is that a bandana? No, it is a, it's a cap. Okay. I mean, it's not really like Ash. It's not It's the, not the right color or anything, but... You know, it is a bit weird. Wait, what's this thing? I'm not raised enough to do anything about that. Can I maybe shoot it? Well, if I'm going to shoot it, I'm going to use less quality ammo, if that's okay. Yeah, fine. And just jump up like a weirdo. Nothing's happening. Okay, well, clearly I can't just jump in there. For whatever reason. Oh! Okay, it's an alarm. Okay, I can jump in there. So that'll be for the area was before. Is any men going to come along and maybe, you know, try and harass me? I wouldn't blame you guys. I have just broken into your, your safe and stolen your card. You know, you might want that back. Okay, this is probably going to get me killed, but... Okay, that's fine. I keep thinking I can't make that jump because it looks so fucking hard. But it's actually really easy. Right, alarm going. Why do they even put an alarm there? Because it's not really doing anything except making noise. Is it meant to make me feel bad about breaking and entering? Because I don't feel bad if this is what I'm meant to do in this game. I was like saying, oh, I should feel bad for eating. Like, eat I should feel bad for eating even though I kind of need food to live. You know, I mean, like, obviously if I'm on a diet, I'd feel bad or something like that. But as long as I get some food in me and, you know, exist, you know, I wouldn't feel bad about eating some food. Yeah, whatever. God, I'm staring at Laura's ass right now, but I'm more intrigued by her shotgun. Did you see how it kind of fused into her shirt there? Why is everyone in this game, like, is, is capable of some weird, strange form of magic, even when magic isn't trying to be illustrated by the game designers? Like, how, how does that even work? Why does the shotgun want to be part of my body now? Okay, fine, whatever. Right, so this should fill up the water over there. Yeah, I'll use my green pass card. Yeah, put it in. Shove it in there. Turns invisible, but that's all right. Is that all it did? Uh, right. What was that meant to achieve exactly? Am I meant to, like, climb down there? Am I not meant to fill it up with water? I thought I was meant to fill it up with water. Okay, well, in the off chance there is something there that I'm just missing out on. I'm going to take a look down, see if there's, like, a ladder or some shit. Right, so there is a ladder over there. That that makes sense, I suppose. But logically, I wouldn't be able to go down that ramp bit. Logically. Go down, down. Yep, flop my legs left and right. Dooby, dooby, doo. There's no way I'm going to make that. It's way too high. So there must be another area I can use that switch or something. I mean, I've unlocked the door, which is great. May even be useful. But, uh, well, I can't see any, like, keyholes or anything that will help me get through that bit. Maybe there's something I'm missing. Maybe there's, I don't know. That lever opened the door down. That's not going to be much use. You know, if you want to fill this place up with water, why don't you just have, a, like, a switch next to the place where you want to fill water up? Why do you have to, like, put it somewhere stupid? Right, well, is there anything over here that I missed? There's a buttons and dials. Switch in there. I'll just unlock the door. For whatever reason, that's meant to be useful. 
Hmm. Okay. This, oh, what's the... Oh, that's alarm! I didn't lose too much health. I'm not bothered about that. Is that another alarm system or is there something else I can use here? No, that's the switch I used to open this bit. So it's not here I need to use, right? Oh, wait, no. Wasn't there another pass I could go through? Because there was a door that locked itself. And I was like, oh, gosh darn it. Maybe I use it there. Or do I need a yellow one for that? I don't know, but I'm just going to guess I need to go this way. Go up here, where there's no alarms. Hopefully there'll never be an alarm again, but we all know there will be. And it'll be fun to listen to, like going in a nightclub and enjoying yourself. Right, so this bit is shut, but is there a a thing I can do here? No, there is not. I remember there being something here. Like a, a key card thing. Is it genuine? I mean, it wouldn't make much sense though, would it? Because... There's still that swimming pool area to worry about. There's going to be nothing over here. I don't even know if I need to be back here, to be honest. Right, well, there's no point using the switch I found here, because that'll just loop me round and I won't get anywhere. I mean, maybe there was something over there that I forgot about, but... I don't know where it would be. That's just a dead end. Am I mad? I swear there was something nearby here. Like a, a keycard system that was used to open that bit. Because we haven't been through that bit yet, I don't think. I don't think. I mean, maybe we have and I'm neglecting it, but I just can't think... Where on earth the keycard bit was? Alright, I'll continue to have a little look around. Just, just for a moment, if you will. Uh, button... Uh... Oh, hold on. Was it this? Was this one I needed to activate? Or was that a different key card? No. no. Okay, well, good. I guess I have nothing. But I do still have a key item, right? Wait, I don't have... Oh. Where did I use the card, then? Oh, that's for the... Sorry, I thought I'd keep it for some reason. Okay, yeah. Sorry, guys. I am an idiot. I am a bit strange. I'm also very stuck on this game right now, and I don't know what this game wants from me. The only thing that card achieved in the end, then, was that it opened a door to a place I've already been to. I mean, what was that meant to... Is that like a timer or something in there? Is there something I'm meant to find that I just didn't realise? I guess we'll see that. In the next episode. I mean, this can't be that hard to figure out. I just need to wander around like a million times and eventually I'll get there. But anyway, if you want to beat me to it, which you probably will if you have a walkthrough and shit, there'll be a link to the game in the description down below. And without further ado, the book's for channel. Until next time, see ya!